It's huge for them. He'll, he'll sit anchor in that midfield. But a player of his experience and his quality will certainly be somebody that the manager will use. Um, the manager obviously had a very, very successful start, and I suspect he will have been reluctant to change his starting 11. But with all the fixtures, with the Champions League and the league fixtures, there's going to have to be a, an amount of squad rotation, and a player like Brozovic, he starts most games. Yeah, they've got so much attacking talent, haven't they, uh, Al Nasser? Not least their number seven, who really is still very much the focal point of their team. And... Um, not really showing any signs of slowing down so far. No, already four goals in the league this season. And at third. Defending that he would enjoy. It's not really his game, and it goes. And comfortable for Gaetan Kuka. Defender. Now with Cristiano Ronaldo. Quick to unleash a shot. And the block made by. And the crowd responding enthusiastically to the no look. Uh, Al Zubaidi, who has the ball. Looking for an opening. Challenge made on him by Al Bouchal. Well, gonna have time to look up, try to pick the pass. Oh, it just ran. Yeah. Al Bouchal. It's a nicely flighted ball, just a little too far in front and above. Taliska in the middle as uh, Sultan into Sadio Mane. Mane. Is Taliska, of whom we were just speaking, Brozovic looking for Mane, jabbed away, important source of creativity and goals, as here comes Sadio Mane racing through. Matches before uh, he was shown the door there, and here he is now in the Saudi Pro League as Mane wins field, but also sit with a lower block defensively. Venturing forward now, uh, but it's Erdogan away. It was the, uh, the centre forward who got it away, and... It's going to be a penalty here. Handball. Well, the pro it's Ronaldo for Al Nasser. And it's 1 0. Five goals in six league matches to start the new campaign. Al Nasser have the lead, and it's taken just over a quarter of an hour. There was only going to be one outcome as soon as that man picked up the ball, wasn't it? You're expecting a goal like everyone in the stadium with the cameras pointed at Ronaldo. That run-up that we've seen so, so often and the end result that we've seen so, so often. Coolness personified. The run-up, we know he waits, looks at the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper goes the wrong way. Paul, he waited. Al Nagati sending it in and the header. Not too far wide from Berte. Mane. Almost forgot the ball there for a moment and then concedes a free kick with the challenge on Hamad Al Magati. Yeah. And Najdi now with a chance to put it into the penalty area. That's Goodmanson back trying to Magati. Nicely crafted pass. And then down under pressure inside the penalty area goes Carlo Muha. Referee says into Ottavio. Zubaidi. Kambari's ball, easy, easy. But away we go once more, and Mane has it. It's a better looking delivery, headed away by Kandu. Working well, brilliant control! Oh, wouldn't that have been a fantastic goal? Are they claiming a handball here? I think they're either claiming a handball or a, pet or a corner. I think the referee's changed his mind, he's been of the uh, on field decision. And it comes from Marcelo Brozovic. Sturds, Cristiano Ronaldo. Into Sadio Mane, 2 0. It's a world class combination. The two biggest stars of Al Nasser combining beautifully to double their lead inside the opening half an hour. The Alaroba defenders thought Cristiano Ronaldo was initially offside down this left-hand side on his run, but he's timed his run to perfection. It's Kurt Zuma in the middle of the screen that's playing him onside. Ronaldo's so aware, sees the run of Sadio Mane, and it's such a tight angle for... Al Bouchal! Oh, keeper had a real problem there! How on earth has Nat not ended up in the back of the net? That's quite extraordinary, both in terms of the gift of a chance that suddenly fell to Sadio Mane, and then his misfortune in not seeing it ripple the net and come bouncing back off the frame of the goal.
support up for this one. Brozovic sends it way beyond everyone, even more creative teammates. How about that for a pass into Mane? Brilliant control. Couldn't squeeze now, which could open up, but the shot without any power at all from Roy. Nice build up though. Good bit of build up. Run. Now it's with Taliska who tees it up. And uh, miscues, which is not something we can say very often. Again, incredible awareness by Cristiano Ronaldo. Puts Taliska in and on his left foot. To the other end with Ronaldo and Seri is back. He's covering some ground in his first half. Last five minutes or so, the national for Brazil on his first cap against England in March. He's given it away. Oh, that was potentially a golden opportunity out of nothing, but Boateng suddenly was stretching to try and receive the ball. It was a gift, a lapse of concentration from the goalkeeper. Now, this is uh, Kandus who sent it back in. And a rare sighting of goal in the first half, and it was Kurt Zuma who stayed up, who got his head on it. Great ball in by Kandus. The centre half finds himself on the right wing. Kurt Zuma away from Noah Fal Bouchal, who makes a stiff challenge on him. There he is again, showing his defensive capabilities. Really. There's a little routine they've worked on, and it was in towards Kurt Zuma. Oh, across goes Zuma. Oh, it's a bad, bad mistake and an even worse miss. The keeper, Gaetan Kuka, put it on a plate for Taliska. And amazingly, for a player who's as lethal as he is in on the stroke of half time here, over it comes. And the header, that was Goodmanson throwing himself at it. Uh, questions being asked to the referee by uh, Emmanuel Berteng in the middle. Don't think he was fouled, he was suggesting that. Positive mindset here as uh, Al Najdi sends it forward, but it's neither cross nor Ronaldo now up against Al Magati. Taliska will come. These are the sort of opportunities they need to try and make the most of, and it comes from Goodmanson and safety. Taliska. Here comes Ronaldo. In towards Otavio at full stretch. Kurt Zuma is there. Times I've seen him this season. Up against Kandus. And it's a corner and for some big clubs along the way. Tello in from Al Magati. Nothing with circumstances such as this. Brozovic sends it across. Ronaldo goes for it. Laporte. Christian Tello whipped in. Decent delivery is Abdullah Al Kandari. Ottavio with a delicate little flick into Brozovic. Magati in. It's a penalty. Referee very quick to blow, and I'm Rick Laporte. I think the player penalised. No penalty. Not for the lack of contact. Well, yeah. And uh, there will not be a yellow card for Emmerich Laporte. Oh, here's Al Bouchal. Oh, crisp, sharp finish from Sadio Mane, his second of the match. Does the flag go up straight away? Quick decision for confirmation, which I think is going to come now. He's onside, it's 3-0. First impressions proved to be correct, and Mane, with a wonderful sharp strike, has his second of the game, Al Nasser's third. 3-0. He's positioned himself at the far post, it was a really good cross in. I think it's Al Bussal again. Really good delivery, and he almost takes it on the half volley, Sadio Mane.